All right, the other day, I took to Twitter, the boys will like this, to note that Hillary Clinton had failed to include Queen Elizabeth in this new book she wrote about gutsy women. Well, that didn't sit well, apparently, with the former Secretary of State and failed presidential candidate, who took time out of her very busy schedule to respond, tweeting, thanks for getting the word out about gutsy, Laura. A book now turned Apple TV Plus docuseries, it was a challenge to narrow down who to feature because it's true, there are just too many amazing women in the world. Well, I don't disagree, Mrs. Clinton. And maybe, maybe I was being unfair to Hillary, guys. I, I, I mean, why include women like Queen Elizabeth or Mother, now St. Teresa, globally recognized for their tireless service to others, when there are so many more deserving gutsy gals out there? Just look at two who were featured on Hillary's TV series, like the foul-mouthed comedian Amy Schumer or Megan the Wop Stallion, whose gutsiness is on display when she tells young girls to shake their butts and spread their legs. But maybe, I don't know, we should have seen this coming because her co-pilot in this effort, daughter Chelsea Clinton, offered an early shot at yours truly last week. We don't, we don't think that any woman should just shut up and sing or shut up and play sports, <laughs> to put it mildly. I'm glad they read my book. Well, if that's the criteria, well, women who are outspoken, I'm surprised that Kathleen Willey, Juanita Broderick, and Paula Jones weren't included in the book. Maybe they'll make it to the second edition. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.